So Brian, you guys have, and your team in general talk a lot about the this sort of future state of where you're transacting in new currencies are more and more ever increasingly a part of the conversation and a larger part of your business. Tell me about that. How does that unfold and what's that look like? Yeah, so there's no secret that um, we're very interested in, in, in transitioning away from uh, traditional uh, media currencies that have been transacted upon for the last 50 years. And so we have a, an entire future of advertising group that is really focused around changing w how we interact with marketers in terms of making sure that ultimately we're providing the most ROI for them for long-term sustainable growth. So you guys have introduced some in new products lately, actually, that are leveraging new currencies. Right. You have a direct-to-consumer one. Can you tell me a little bit about that? Right, yeah. So we, uh, we recently announced a partnership um, with a company called Giant Spoon in which we are uh, focused mainly on direct-to-consumer brands that they represent. Um, but not only that, the opportunity is really for us to be able to expand our uh, roster of advertisers beyond the, the current uh, more traditional legacy advertisers, ultimately to provide ultimate value for these direct-to-consumer advertisers. So, I'm sorry, so the roles of currencies, it seems like there's a couple of different things here. There's a new currencies can deliver greater ROI to your advertisers. It sounds like there's new products and innovations. I mean, do you also believe that it's going to be better business for you? Yeah, we, we are ultimately focused on consumers and our marketers, right, and providing the, the best high quality content for our consumers ultimately to lead to better results and, be, and a better environment for our marketers. And so with that, um, we're looking at currencies that measure impact and outcome as opposed to just looking at traditional currencies, which ultimately we're not able to uh, tie business results to traditional measurement right. currencies. So if you look forward into the future, would you suggest that it's, it's your marketer or brand's business needs and business success metrics that defines or will inform the currency with which you transact? 100%. We are constantly talking to marketers about what's important to them, what drives their business, what fuels growth for them, and ultimately we're looking to build a solution that, uh, that drafts off of what those uh, results that they need to be, uh, that drafts off of those business needs to ultimately to, de to deliver the most amount of value to the advertiser. And I suspect that many advertisers will have different KPIs and it's, it's gonna be a, a upon us to be as nimble as possible to be able to achieve those results for them.